gorgeous beaches, a delicious culinary scene, festive culture, and ancient pyramids all make Mexico a popular tourist destination. Mexico is a land of color and contrast. Crowded beaches lead into quiet colonial towns, while resort cities open gateways to jungles ringing with parrots and howler monkeys. Majestic mountains descend into remote deserts. Traditional Pueblo houses sit near Spanish haciendas. Ruins of Mayan cities lie excavated outside of modern metropolises. The capital, Mexico City, is a huge metropolis boasting a historical center, top museums, and chic shopping opportunities. Another popular destination on our list of the best places to visit in Mexico is the enigmatic town of Oaxaca, home to colonial architecture and a fantastic Day of the Dead festival. Traces of its pre-Columbian past can be found in Teotihuacan, with its pyramid dating back to 200 CE, and at the archaeological site of Chichen Itza in the Yucatan Peninsula. 1. Tosca Surrounded by rolling hills, valleys, and mountains, Tosca is set in a very scenic spot, some 170 kilometers to the southwest of Mexico City. Besides the lovely landscapes and breathtaking views, the city is also known for its colonial architecture and intricately carved artisanal silverware. Presiding over everything is the beautiful Baroque architecture of Santa Prisca Cathedral, the city's symbol and main site. From atop its bell towers, you can enjoy fabulous panoramas over Tosca's surroundings, as well as a bird's eye view of the narrow, steep streets weaving their way up the hillside. Much of the city was built from the wealth mined from the nearby mountains. Exquisite silver jewelry can still be bought to this day. Nowadays, however, Tosca's economy is mainly based on the steady stream of tourists who come to delve into its rich history, culture, and architecture. Holy Week is a good time to visit Tosca because of its All Souls processions, where residents turn out to show their faith. 2. Los Cabos Regarded as the marlin sport fishing capital of the world, Los Cabos has rapidly gained popularity over the last few decades as a top tourist destination in Mexico due to its beautiful resort beaches, excellent scuba diving, whale watching experiences, and lively party scene. Located in the Mexican state of Baja California, Sur, Los Cabos is composed of two towns, San Jose and San Lucas, that are divided by 20 miles of scenic highway known as the Corridor. While the former mission town of Cabo San Jose is a traditional Mexican town with colonial architecture and a relaxed, quiet ambience, Cabo San Lucas is one of Mexico's fastest-growing tourist destinations featuring luxury resorts, upscale restaurants, championship golf courses, and a glittering party scene. San Lucas is also a hot spot for water sports that include scuba diving, parasailing, snorkeling, and glass bottom boat tours. Sporting a splendid coastline dotted with gated residential communities and high-end resorts, the corridor is home to beautiful beaches like Chilino Beach, which is favored for its crystal-clear waters and marine life. Cabo San Lucas is also known for its natural attraction, Land's End, which features a cluster of rocks shaped by the sea and wind into distinctive formations. One particular rock, El Arco, is a good spot to view sea lions. 3. Cozumel Located in the Caribbean Sea on the Yucatan Peninsula, the 30-mile island of Cozumel is one of the top diving destinations in the Western Hemisphere. For this reason, dive shops abound all over the island. Except for the calm beaches at Chankanab National Park, the island's ocean current and wind conditions are not ideal for swimming, but Cozumel's beaches are ripe for surfing and parasailing. However, there are many beach hotels that offer swimming pools. Other water activities include deep-sea fishing and glass-bottom boat tours. Cozumel is one of Mexico's most visited cruise port of calls, 
and tourists will find the cruise docks bustling with vendors selling a variety of souvenirs, from t-shirts to tequila. The main town on the island, San Miguel, offers a myriad of shops, entertainment venues, and restaurants. In addition to beach fun, Cozumel offers other fascinating attractions, such as the Mayan archaeological sites of San Gervasio and El Caracol. Chancanab National Park is a great place to explore nature trails, stroll along beautiful botanical gardens, and view numerous iguanas. 4. Guanajuato Guanajuato, the capital of the state with the same name, doesn't lack charm. Cobblestone lanes, sidewalk cafes, and some of the most stunning Baroque architecture in North America give it a European flavor and are among Guanajuato's drawing cards. The city also has a network of underground tunnels that serve as roads, making this place really unique in the world. Founded in 1559, Guanajuato quickly became famous for its gold and silver mines. Some of the mines can be visited today. This includes La Valencia, one of the richest silver mines in the world. Next to the mine is the Church of San Cayetano, lavishly adorned with silver and gold. The city is a good place to enjoy traditional mariachi music. 5. Oaxaca The capital city of the state by the same name, Oaxaca, is located in a valley below the Sierra Madre Mountains. Colonial architecture, archaeological sites, a pleasant climate, and a tranquil atmosphere make it a popular tourist destination in southern Mexico. At the heart of Oaxaco is its charming town square, Zocalo, where tourists can admire beautiful colonial landmarks like the Santo Domingo Church, tour museums, shop for souvenirs, and relax at an outdoor cafe. Several archaeological sites around the city can be explored, such as Monte Alban. Perched on a mountain, Monte Alban was the site of the ancient capital city of the Zapotec inhabitants. A visit here presents impressive views of the valley. The site of Mitla is intriguing for its walls of geometric patterns. Oaxaca is also known for its unique food dishes, such as mole, which involves the likes of a sauce made with chocolate and chiles. The city's favorite drinks, mezcal and hot chocolate, are easily found in every restaurant and bar. Traditional Oaxican handicrafts are regarded worldwide, and the city's markets are good places to purchase popular items like Zapotec wool rugs, wood carvings, and black pottery. One of the best Day of the Dead festivals in Mexico takes place in Oaxaca, as does the Gelaguetza, a festival exhibiting the traditional dances of local indigenous cultures. 6. Puerto Vallarta Situated on the Bay of Banderas along Mexico's Pacific coast in the state of Jalisco is the popular vacation city of Puerto Vallarta. Landscapes of gorgeous beaches and lush jungle mountains envelope this picturesque town of colonial landmarks, first-class resorts, gourmet restaurants, and dozens of nightclubs. The city's main attraction, the Golden Sand Beaches, offer relaxation and water sports such as sailing, kite surfing, and deep sea fishing. As Puerto Vallarta is a popular diving destination, there are many dive shops located along the beaches. Giant manta rays and dolphins can be viewed here, while humpback whales can be seen between December and March. Lined with shops, restaurants, and bars, the beautiful boardwalk, the Malacan, is a great place to shop, dine, socialize, watch street performers, and view the ocean. Outside of the city, tourists can tour mango and papaya plantations or visit quiet fishing villages and secluded coves. The lush hills and mountains offer hiking and horseback riding trails in addition to canopy and ziplining adventures. 7. Teotihuacan Located just 50 kilometers to the northeast of Mexico City, Teotihuacan is home to some of the largest and most awe-inspiring pyramids on Earth. 
While its origins and the identities of its founders are shrouded in mystery, the city later became one of the most impressive and influential cities in the Americas. At its zenith in the first half of the first millennium, the sprawling metropolis boasted countless buildings, as well as huge temples and palaces, squares, and stadia. Although it was already abandoned by the time of the Aztecs, they named the ruined city Teotihuacan, or birthplace of the Odes, as TH they believed that it was here that the universe was created. While its star waned long ago, the might of the ancient Mesoamericans is still on display at the extensive and astonishing archaeological site. Well-preserved murals and buildings can be found along the famous Avenue of the Dead. The massive Pyramid of the Sun and the Pyramid of the Moon are its two standout attractions. 8. Tulum The Tulum ruins are a walled Maya city perched on a rocky cliff overlooking the Caribbean on the Yucatan Peninsula, Mexico. The site is of modest scale and was built during the post-classic period, when the Mayan culture was in decline and therefore lacks the elegance of some other famous Mayan ruins. The tropical beach backdrop, however, makes this a unique site that should not be missed. The most imposing building in Tulum is the 25-foot, 7.5-meter, tall El Castillo, the castle, set above the cliff. It was once covered in stucco and painted. A small shrine appears to have been used as a beacon for incoming canoes. On the beach below, where the canoes came ashore, Tourists combine a visit to the Mayan ruins with a dip in the Caribbean. It is important to know that there are really three different areas, all referred to as Tulum, located near each other but not close enough to walk to and from. The town center, sometimes referred to as Tulum Pueblo, lies across the highway south of the Coba Junction. There are frequent buses to Cancun, Merida, Playa del Carmen, and Viado lead from the town center. Tulum Playa, or Zona Hotelera, extends for more than 6 miles 10 kilometers of great white sandy beaches along the Caribbean coastline, while Tulum Ruinas is the archaeological site where the Tulum Mayan ruins stand. 9. Mexico City The capital of Mexico, Mexico City, is one of the world's largest cities, comprised of many ethnic groups from all over the globe. Not only is this vast city the most important political and cultural center in Mexico, but it is also one of the most important financial centers in Latin America. Moreover, Mexico City boasts one of North America's oldest and largest universities. While there are no beaches in Mexico City, tourists will discover a great number of exciting things to see and do. The historic center is teeming with prominent landmarks such as the Plaza de la Constitution, the Metropolitan Cathedral, the National Palace, and the ruins of an ancient Aztec temple. With hundreds of museums, art galleries, and performing arts centers, Mexico City is one of the world's leading cities of arts and culture. In addition to public parks like the impressive Chapultepec Park, the city also boasts the must-see Xochimilco Floating Gardens. Many of Mexico City's neighborhoods can be easily reached by the large metro system. For safety reasons, avoid hailing a cab in the street. Instead, ask the hotel to call a cab. A good way to see the city's main attractions is by taking the Touribus, a hop-on, hop-off sightseeing bus. 10. Chichen Itza Situated in the Yucatan Peninsula, Chichen Itza is the most famous, most visited, and most impressive of the country's many Mayan sites. This is somewhat ironic because its most famous structures do not have typical classic Mayan architecture but show strong influences from other civilizations in central Mexico. While the scorching sun and teeming crowds can put some people off, it is not without reason that the astounding archaeological ruins were selected as one of the new seven wonders of the world. Built between the 9th and 12th centuries, the once great city covers a huge area, and many of its buildings, temples, 
and palaces are still in remarkably good condition. These feature a wide array of different architectural styles and offer a fascinating insight into the Mayan civilization. The undeniable highlight is the Pyramid of Kukulkan, or El Castillo, which is the site's most famous landmark. The hulking temple stone terraces dominate Chichen Itza, and were ingeniously constructed to give the illusion of serpents crawling down the side of the pyramid. Many tourists visit Chichen Itza as a day trip, especially from Cancun or Merida, but it is also possible to stay a night or two here.